This is a Fujitsu life book, as you can see, which needs a new screen. The screen for this can easily be removed just by pulling out here. There's no screws holding the front down, just plastic grips. And then once you have taken off those, the front, there's a screw here, 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 and here. So you can take those screws off and carefully you will see the back of the display panel. The display panel has a part number here which uh, isn't focusing but let's see what we can do. There we go. Right, so you can use that part number just there uh, to uh, order up your panel. Having got the part number of the screen, I did a Google search and ended up buying the, a replacement screen from laptop-lcd-screen.co.uk who is offering a, a cashback for doing a YouTube video of fitting one of their screens. Now, this is the connector from the laptop to the panel. So there is it. A little bar along here, which snaps over this connector to hold it in place. And that can just be eased out and there is the old one. Most laptops take fairly generic panels as long as you've got the resolution right and the technology right whether it's LED backlit or whether it's uh, fluorescent. Fluorescent backlit usually has a second connector uh, which drives a driver circuitry along the bottom for powering the backlight. So sometimes uh, if your screen goes really dim then that can be the uh, driver circuitry for the fluorescent backlight if it's a fluorescent one. The LED ones are all integrated so that's something separate. So here we go, here's our new um, screen. So we just have to line that up nicely. Hmm. Fiddly things. Especially when you're trying to show it on camera at the same time. Right. There we go, that slid in and then we put our engaging bar back down, that just there we go, last little tuck holds it in place and so now we've got the new connector on, this moves back turn it around to here And now that is done, we can reconnect the screws, which I put safety elsewhere. 
now to uh, affix the screws. And the fun bit, peeling off the protective um, coating. Wonderful reflections there in my office. And putting the front plate, this just has plastic clips on it. So, very easy to take off, and uh, there we go, all the way around, but they do, they can snap off with ageing, so you do want to ease them, when you're taking them off, you want to ease them off, and that's you, all we have to do is start the thing up, make sure it actually behaves. That certainly looks okay to me. Right, there you go.